Hello everyone, welcome back to another video of Dragon City. So it's been a while since we did a video on Dragon City because they didn't have any new dragons. Also, they started re-releasing the Pirate Island. I know that one ended not too long ago, but we didn't do a video on that because we already looked at the Octopus Dragon as well as the Jelly Dragon, I think that was the name of it. But we're here with the Basilisk Dragon, which is available from the breeding sanctuary you may notice that right here there's about 30 something seconds left and that's because i've been sitting here waiting for the dragon every couple hours you come back hey when is this dragon hatching so this dragon took a really really long time to hatch and i think this is the last of the breeding sanctuary island that means that we've gotten all of the dragons in the breeding sanctuary. Let me know if anything is missing. I think this is the last one. Alright, let's just get out of here and go back in here. I think six seconds is left. Four, three, two, one. Alright, so it's ready to hatch. And let's do this. Right here, two element dragon, element of flame, and element of here. Now let's place the dragon into habitat. We'll take a look at the dragon in the game. Alright, where did it go? Alright, so right there. Really tiny, cute looking dragon. You see his adorable eyes. He looks like a fish type of dragon. Here it is. Let's just wait until, or I guess... We'll exit and go in until he does his animation. There it is, his animation. I don't know what he's spitting out of there. It's like green. It's either poison or something. But it, it's green. And he kind of spits it up into the air and then it comes back down at him. So that's what he does in his baby form. I'm not sure how that has anything to do with flame and pier. I think that's more like water. But... Let's go level him up to the second form. And then we'll talk about how to breed him it later on in the video. So this is the second form. As you can see, there's a lot of fins and stuff like that. Also a bit of design. You notice the black markings on his back as well as his thighs. Yeah, he has a lot of thin fins. <laughs> this dragon just looks like an aquatic dragon. But I don't know why it's flame and pier. Maybe it should be a three element dragon. That's what I think. It should be like sea, flame, and pier. But then again, that will make it much harder to breed. So I guess two element dragon is good. Alright, so here it is. We're going to exit, go back in, and then exit, go back in, exit, go back in. We're trying to get the animation in here. Unfortunately, it's not showing up. Alright, I think the animation is loading. I I'm not really sure why it's not showing up right now. But let's go back in. Oh, there it is. There it is. Hey, this guy looks familiar. I think he's part of a cartoon. He looks really familiar. I don't remember the name. <laughs> Alright, so there it is. He shoots this guy with like a green splotch. This guy looks really familiar. He reminds me of The Simpsons. But it's in another cartoon. And I don't get his, what he's pulling. Whoops. Alright, you'll notice that the what he's pulling, the animation kind of gets cut off there. You don't really see what he's pulling. And on top of that, the, the rope is cut off by, I don't know, a box. I guess the animation is boxed. They don't really have anything there. But there it is. This guy looks really familiar, but I cannot remember what his name is off the top of my head. That's what it does for a second form. Also, when he does that, when the dragon is spitting at him, it re oh yes, this is what it reminds me of. It reminds me of the Dilophosaurus. Yeah, in Jurassic Park where, oh yes, yes, that is it. That is the guy that <laughs> reminds me of the Jurassic Park guy. Right, he's pulling the car, and he's spinning the thing there. That's what it is. Oh, the, 
The guy is Nedry, I believe that's what his name was. But Jurassic Park was such a long movie. I mean, well, Jurassic Park was released so long ago. I don't exactly remember every detail. But if you go back and watch it, this is the guy that kind of betrayed the park owner, Hammond. And what happened was he got eaten by a Dilophosaurus, I believe. His car was stuck in the river and then he it, it jumped up and kind of ate him so that's what it that's what he reminds me of i was wondering why he looks so familiar but there it is jurassic park builder let's call <laughs> i mean jurassic park dragon that's what i'm calling him so there it is the second form where let's evolve him to the last form and check out his animation and then we'll talk about how to breed him but once I, no wonder he, he looks so familiar. If you haven't watched Jurassic Park, I know some of you, the Jurassic Park is a relatively old movie, but it's still a really, really good movie. Yeah, Jurassic Park was released in 1993. So some of you might not have seen it. If you haven't, you should definitely check it out. Awesome movie. Let's go out of there and go back in here. Alright, so his first and second animation I, I get a bit. He was spitting that green stuff. That green stuff is the blind people. But I don't get what the last one is. The last one has nothing to do with Jurassic Park. But he's dancing and he's running and then he, he falls into the water. You'll notice that the dragon has arms. You notice that his front limbs and his back limbs are different. I guess his front arms and his back legs are different. It's not the same. It looks really different. It looks like this is in the beginning or at the, in the front. And this is a relatively big dragon on the screen. But, you know, it's normal size here. I don't, I can, I don't think it's any bigger. But if you go in here, it looks gigantic. It's cover up the entire, most of the menu or the, the card that he, most dragons are in. But anyways, how you breed this dragon is what I use is the flame dragon and the pure dragon. You could simply use that combination, but you can use that, any other combination with pure and flame. But you must use the breeding sanctuary here, and you must have unlocked it to breeding sanctuary level 8. If you don't have it at level 8, you won't be able to get the dragon. So, that is pretty much it in terms of breeding time. It's going to take a pretty long time to breed. 54 hours for breeding and another 72 hours for the egg to hatch All right, that is about it for this video. That is how you breed this dragon for Dragon City